Julian Alvarez received an amazing welcome on his return to the Manchester City Training Center on Friday, 12 days after Argentina won the World Cup in Qatar. From the entrance to the dinning area, everyone stood up to congratulate the Argentine forward for his incredible performance that helped his nation to their third World Cup title. Even the Premier League top scorer Erling Haaland made sure to offer his commendation to Alvarez, who registered four goals in six matches, a monumental tally that inspired the Albisless march to glory for the first time in 36 years. The city number 19 was also treated to a champion's massage table with a World Cup replica on the side and a bell to call the Meshur without leaving the table. At the training ground, the players held a guard of honor for the 22-year-old before throwing him in the air in a gratifying scene. It was such a heartwarming gesture from his teammates who included Dutch defender Nathan Ake, who together with the Netherlands team were knocked out of the tournament by Alvarez and his mates in a fiercely contested quarterfinal tie that went all the way to the penalty shootout following a 2-2 draw in extra time. Ahead of Manchester City's end-of-year fixture against Everton, Alvarez was passionately cheered on by the citizen supporters outside the Etihad Stadium as the players checked in for pre-match preparations. And before kickoff, the striker was called upon to greet the supporters who gave him a standing ovation as he waved back with his glittering World Cup gold medal dangling on his neck. With six goals and 14 appearances for City this season already, it will be fascinating to see whether Alvarez picks where he left in Qatar when he gets back to full fitness in the Premier League. While the young Argentine comes second in the pecking order after Holland, the goal machine, Pep Guardiola can be sure to count on him anytime the need arises up front.